I'm at Fat Bastard Burrito in Canada. Hey everybody, Sweatpants Joe here, and it's time for another fun food review. Today I'm checking out Fat Bastard Burrito. It's kind of like the Canadian Chipotle, I want to say, only they have a lot more options than Chipotle. But I got a burrito. I got a pulled pork burrito. I didn't get the biggest size burrito that they offer. This one's still really, really freaking big. Look at the size of this thing. It's, it's big, very big. Normally I would say it's huge, but they have a burrito that is, they go small, big, huge. So I gotta imagine the huge is even bigger than this. This is still very big. I also ordered a chicken empanada. I love empanadas. I'm gonna try the empanada first. I went on YouTube because I, you know, I drive around Canada a lot and I've seen Fat Bastard Burrito. Ken Domic seems to have the Fat Bastard Burrito reviews on lockdown. He, he's reviewed a whole bunch of them. Go check out his reviews. I love Ken Domic's food reviews. Now it's my turn. Time to get an American's perspective on Fat Bastard. Let's try the empanada first. I got the chicken empanada. Oh yeah, yeah, that's really good. Uh, it's full of chicken and and uh, delicious, delicious chicken. I got this Thai chili dipping sauce. I'm gonna try it in, dipping it in the dipping sauce. Here we go. Oh no. Yeah, that was that was the way to go. I knew as soon as she said. Thai chili. I'm like, yep, yep. Thai chili, give it to me, yeah. Thai chili, give it to me, yeah. This empanada is delicious. Reminds me of the empanadas at Pollo Campero but the dipping sauce puts it over the top. This is really, really good, guys. Really good. But now, now it's time to try what they're famous for. Time to try the straw that serves the drink at Fat Bastard Burrito. And that is their burrito. First, I wanted to point something out to you guys. You see the markings on the outside of the burrito? Unlike Chipotle, when they finish the burrito, they put it on a flat top grill for a few minutes. Get it nice and charred for you. Let's give this a bite. This is a pulled pork burrito. I got a lot of fixins on it. Here we go. So what's on this is pulled pork. I got rice, black beans, cilantro, corn, coleslaw. There's some salsa and a burrito sauce on it. I haven't gotten to that part yet. Let's give this another bite. Everything is good. I love all the different flavors that it's got going on. Oh, the crunchiness of the coleslaw. There's lettuce on there too. Um, I should have asked for more cheese, but it's really good. I'm really not tasting any of the salsa. It's probably on this side of the burrito. They also have different flavors of jaritos in there. I got a Mexican Coke though. Okay, now for a rating on a scale of P.U. It Stinks to Sunshine Lollipops and Rainbows. I give Fat Bastard Burrito Fat Bastard Burrito Company, excuse me. I'm going to give it, and I like it a lot. The burrito's really good. The ingredients are good. I like how they throw it on the flat top at the end. 
empanadas where it's at. I could eat like six of those. Those are delicious. Uh, let me know in the comments below. What else should I have tried at Fat Bastard Burrito? I was Like I was saying earlier, I was watching all of Ken Domic's food reviews. And he, he got a lot of stuff and a lot of it looked really good. I remember he ordered the fish tacos. And they just look like a giant fish fry. This place is awesome. Thank you guys for watching. Rock on!